Senator Pan Filolacson files graft and economic sabotage complaints before the Office of the Ombudsman against former Customs Commissioner Nicanor Faeldon over alleged involvement in rice smuggling. Lacson also implicates nine others for conspiring to smuggle 40,000 bags of rice to Cebu Light Trading Incorporated without payment of customs taxes and duties and without the required import permit. He says the nine supposedly used fake permits. Lacson says two shipments of rice entered the country through the port of Cagayan de Oro without necessary permits. The first shipment was on March 9 this year, containing 21,800 bags of Vietnamese long-grain white rice, valued at $370,600. Laxon says another shipment came in the next day, with 18,200 bags of Vietnamese long-grain white rice, valued at $309,400. On April 26, the shipments were declared abandoned and forfeited in favor of the government and will be disposed of. But Laxon says National Food Authority Administrator Jason Aquino disregarded this and issued a certification and confirmation for the shipments on May 17. Aquino supposedly ordered that these import permits would retroact to cover the actual date of arrival. Laxon says Faeldon heeded Aquino's advice and ordered the release of the two rice shipments to CLTI. The senator says the government was deprived of the use and benefit of the abandoned shipments worth $680,000 or more than 34 million pesos.